Hey everyone, welcome to Quiet as a Stone. Um, I saw this game online and it looked absolutely beautiful, so I thought it'd be fun to play it with you all and check it out together. Um, I don't know much about it, but from uh, the description it says it's a uh, sort of a game for casual creators. I guess a slow minimalist game for casual creators, so I'm intrigued to see what that means. Um, looks like we can move ourselves around here a little bit. Oh yeah, we can even use the keyboard here to move quite a bit. Within the ruins, an alluring lantern. There's a grass stone here. We can pick this up and move it. Okay. Oh. Oh, it's got some common shards here. Oh, and gems. Okay, and we can see our gem counter went up here by grabbing those. Oh, explorer guide movement. Uh, activate. Cool. Grab the floor to move the camera position. The camera can also be rotated and zoomed in and out. Okay, so that's kind of what we've been doing here. Uh, with my settings, it's a little hard to move with the mouse, but the keyboard works well. Okay, and then we've got some shards here. Whoa, that's a lot of gems. Okay, let's grab those. Okay. Ah, there's a welcome here. Fantastic, hello. Welcome to Quiet as a Stone. Not a soul here, an alluring illumination among the wilderness. And then gems. Collect small gems. They are precious. All but your gems are left behind when you move on. Okay. So, gems are kind of the most important thing then, I guess. Got these. Oh. Wow, this is really beautiful. Grass stone. Unbreakable side. There's some more gems hidden. Whoa! Grab them. Ah, I want to get the ones before they fall off the cliff. Explorer's Guide interacts. Interact with objects using the 3D hand cursor. You can often grab items and place them where you like. All right, let's move the books we've read over here. Same thing with these stones. We've read that. We read the welcome. Common shard, unbreakable stone. Okay. Grass stones, we're moving those over here. What else do we got? Explorers Gad Explore. Explore the countryside using your map. What can you find? What can you create? Okay. Camera. Use your camera to photograph your discoveries. You may never see the scene again. Whoop, whoop, whoop. All right, we're up to 53 odd gems here. Stone. Okay, now what else is there? What is this? Is it like a sword? Thunder cracked across the darkness. Oh, I see. We can um, trim the grass here. Oh, but I don't want to ruin it. Swipe, it says. Interesting. What else do we have? More grass. Okay, so this is kind of our camp's fire spot. Oh, it's really pretty. Okay, now. We can take a picture. Whoa. Move focus. Move camera. Pan camera. Cool. Landscape square portrait. Oh, cool. Different kind of settings here. Film standard's kind of cool. You can change the focus level here. Or the aperture. Oh, and the zoom. Let's zoom out would be my recommendation. Oh, maybe we'll zoom in. Maybe I take that back. Catch a picture of this fire. Cool. Interesting. All right. Now, log. What does the log say? The log button toggles the display of your explorer's log. Oh, this is a bunch of stuff about the camera, it looks like. And pretty much everything we've learned. Cool, okay. All right, so now it recommended that we check out the map. Oh, okay, what do we got? Redport, snow falls, remains of an old floor, an unobstructed area, on the edge of a misty wood. A tall spired building can be seen, onset of evening, scattered with many large rocks. A balanced stone circle surrounds the site. Okay, Azurhagen. 
Snow falls, cracked tiles on the floor, an area free of features or obstruction near an ancient wild wood. Sunset, scattered with many large rocks. A balanced stone circle surrounds the site. And die fairy finger. Flakes of snow fall. A paved floor, a simple flat space near a wood. A spire in the distance. Onset of evening, scattered with many large rocks. A balanced stone circle surrounds the site. Let's start with red port. Okay, the beginning once stood here. Interesting. Oh, look at this. This is pretty. All right, what do we got here? Unremarkable stone. You're holding an object. Oh, let's get rid of the log. Can we dismiss the log? Yeah, there we go. Crystal shard, pot of nature. I like the fireplace. Oh, I see. This is how we move the camera with the mouse. And this is just to rotate, like, physically where we are. Got it. Okay. Crystal shard. Whoa, that's a lot of gems. Rock mount obelisk. Oh, you can move the actual, some of the smaller rocks. Interesting. Not the big ones, though. Small rocks of red port. Unremarkable stone. All right, let's bust all this up. So do we see any more crystals? Oh, a pot of gems. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't, ah, don't lose them. I don't, I don't know how, why I care so much about actually collecting these things, but, you know, it feels like I should, right? Okay. That was a pot, unremarkable stone. Okay, obelisk. It's like I kind of want to put that somewhere cool, you know? Yeah, like here we go. Oh, there's some lights in the distance. Campside poems on a limitless sickness. So what's a pot of nature? I don't know. It doesn't seem like you can move it. Interesting. rocks you can move common shard we can move or bust open these it swipes which I don't want to do because I think they're pretty alright what else do we got over here some light coming from back here or fog maybe Just fog stone alright what's a cool setup we can make then this was an inspired kingdom So we could put these rocks like here. This is the obelisk. Well, let's get a picture like this. Oh, that's cool. It's controlling the focus. Pan the camera. I still haven't quite figured out how to move the camera. Maybe you're not supposed to. Maybe that's part of the challenge? I don't know. I mean, it would be nice to just be able to see the fire, right? Oh, landscape's kind of pretty. zoom it on this rock I guess okay oops oh, I got it just in time okay let's jump back out to the map so it's not clear that there's sort of a specific objective as much as just like trying to make things look pretty and explore them but visually it's beautiful okay lamb death a plane cracked tiles on the floor boulders on either side a large circle of stones the sky peels soon it will be dusk a thick forest grove near a tall spire hawks market set within a rocky enclave a stone floor misty within a wooded land a tall spired building can be seen many small rocks scattered around midnight some rocks arranged carefully and narrow sorrow set within a rocky enclave a rocky floor shrouded in fog within a foreboding wooden land spires visible 
Many small rocks scattered around at night, a cairn. Uh, we'll go to Vlam Death. So I assume these are all procedurally generated, including the kind of texts that um, you get. Whoa. It's a trippy, like, donut thing. Super trippy donut thing. All right, we got some gems to collect. Whee. All right, we're now over 100 gems. Cool. Greater common shard. Whoa. What are these? Okay, we've got a shard of artifacts. Which got me a pot of gems, I think. Did that get a pot of gems? Oh, that's how you get it open. <gasps> oh, I did not know that. Now I'm sad we missed all those gems. The last location. Okay, interesting. Alright, so maybe there are tricks where you can combine things. Whoop, get all these. There's no f campfire here, is there? It's kind of sad. Decaying stand? Oh, you can duplicate it. Oh, interesting. Oh, very interesting. Stone. What does activating a stone do? It's not clear. Dead bomb. It's like a plant. Okay. Okay, so there's some more. If we can duplicate things, that's going to be interesting. And if we can combine things, that's going to be interesting. Crystal. Whoa, look at all these gems. It's interesting how it's like very satisfying to get gems, even if I have no idea if they matter. It's just like, oh, it feels good to get them. Um, mine shard. Okay, so you can duplicate those. Alright, what is the shard of nature? Oh, we could, we can duplicate these too, okay. Stone? Is that a stone? Looks like a mushroom almost. Wait, what is he saying? Well, now I could hold. What did you say, buddy? Why is a stone talking? Okay. Now, what would I like to do with this place? I find this, like, hole up here really intriguing. Why does it say minus one? Oh, it's using a gem to make these. Oh. Weird. So I want to do like this. We're going to stack all these in here. We have a circle around. Oh. Pardon me. Kind of a circle in the middle. And then I don't think realistically you would have trees growing up here. But maybe they could be growing around. Yeah, that looks like weirdly man-made, which I think is kind of cool. That's only to swipe, swipe. The conifers, though. I mean, could you put it up here? I would have let you put it up here. That's kind of weird. I bet people who are like really creative could make some cool stuff with this. You know? Where else is something I can pick up? I think that's a conifer. I can pick that up. Whoa. Almost missed that. A mount. What is a mount for? Weird. Timber. Cool. All right, let's duplicate some of these. Okay, 
so what do we got now? Kind of a trippy little stone. Timber from the low walled of lamb death. Weird. Cool. I kind of like that it's a little like artificial stone campfire surrounded with the trees. Like the trees are people and the rocks are the campfire and those rocks are the fire. I don't know. Something like that. Oh, cool. Okay, we can get a better picture now. Oh. Yeah, let's do... Let's zoom in a little more, maybe? Yeah, like this. And then... Maybe a little bit more open so you can actually get it all into focus. Yeah. Portrait might work. And then... Oh, that's pretty. Black and white's pretty. And I wonder if there's a... Yeah, there we go. Space bar takes the picture. Perfect. Okay, back to the map. Final hair flight. Distant, rocky and stony floor. Snow falls. The sun is... We haven't done one with snow, have we? The sun is rising, scattered with many large rocks. The remains of an old statue. Man market. Three large rocks on the edge. Near a spooky warded grove. A spire is visible. Cracked tiles on the floor. Sunset. A gale throws up dust. Many small rocks scattered around. Remains of an ancient wall. And hard killed. Three large rocks on the edge. On the edge of a wheeled paved floor. Soon it will be dusk. Forceful winds. Many small uh, rocks scattered around. The remains of an ancient wall. Um... This sounds interesting. Final hair flight. The snow and a statue. Whoa, look at that statue. Oh, and there's a fire. That's great. Look at that thing. That thing is really weird. Very cool. Get some of these gems. Oh, grab it. Thank you. Fire and solitude. Just like spins around and won't grab it. Whoa! Shard of artifacts. I don't think it'll let me. Yeah, it wouldn't let me duplicate one of these, would it? No. Oh. Shakes the whole camera when you grab them. Rocky Mount of Final Hair Flight. Got a pillar. Oh, weird. Look at that. It is a little pillar. under there. You can put the pillar up here. Huh. Grab some of these gems. I don't see any more hidden. Oh. Uh, hard to get it when it's about to fall off. Alright, so there's a pillar here. I don't know what that should mean. Maybe put it right here. I like this tree. The night fell. Oh, cool. Is the night gonna fall? If you duplicate, is it identical? No. Oh, you can rotate it too. Oh, and make it bigger and smaller. Whoa. Let's put a giant tree back here. Oh, this is cool. Oh, that gave me a gem. I thought it was gonna take away a gem. Does it always give you a gem? Like if I duplicate, yeah, sometimes it takes it away. But if I grow it, oh, I'm not sure. Put 
with some little... I mean, it seems like trees should be bigger than they are, right? Let's put a big one over here. There we go. That's starting to look pretty cool. Well, what else do we have to work with? Oh, there's a little gem. Some bushes over here, a rock. I like the way this is looking. Maybe we put this back. More back up. Hold on. Let's put you not there at all. That makes no sense. Like back here and a little bigger. Yeah, there we go. There, this is starting to look a little bit more reasonable. Let's actually clear the brush away from um, right next to the fire. You wouldn't want, you wouldn't normally want grass this close to a fire, I don't think. Floor ruins, got it. I see sometimes you get like gems and stuff. There. That looks pretty cool. That looks bigger. Yeah. Like, I could see this being a cool campfire by this weird toppled... Toppled, um... Statue. Okay, how do we zoom out? There we go. That's the right angle. Uh, I think we... We'll do square. We'll do it Instagram style. I liked standard. Film standard's a little cold. I'll do one of those standard ones, like standard or standard warm. I kind of like standard, actually. And then... Oh, that is cool to catch. I mean, we could do landscape. It just feels so wide, though. Oh, we'll do square. And then maybe less wide, like... Yeah, like this looks really good. Cool. Oh, I'm excited with those pictures, weirdly. <laughs> okay, map. Boys Shore, daytime, many small rocks scattered around, a clear sky, a dead tree, buttressed by large rocks close to a forest, a patch of stones and dirt. Uh, high, sunrise, high is interesting. Su sunrise, rock formation on the sides resemble stairs. Rocky and stony floor, it's raining here, a cairn, many small rocks scattered around. This is interesting. Dwarven mill, scattered with many large rocks, a huge old head, a rocky and stony floor, flakes of snow fall, morning high. Let's try Lion's Fear, because the stairs sound interesting. We've already seen a statue head. Interesting. Where are the stairs? Is it this that are the stairs? Or these? Huh. Oh. Get the moon up here, too. Look at that. Or is that the sun? I think it's the moon? I guess I don't really know behind the clouds. Whoa. Get all the gems for no apparent reason. I don't want to leave them around, you know? Take pictures with gems. Ah, perhaps I can pick it up? I can. What does activating it do? This makes me suspicious that like if I put it in the right spot, something would happen. But I don't know what spot. Whoa. Whoa, so many gems. so many gems. It's gone through day and night while we just grab all these gems. Come around here. These rocks are cool. I guess these are the... Well, either of these are the staircase ones. Oops. A sun-warmed lion's fear.
Cool, alright, so... Let's do that there. Again, we'll trim some of the fire... Ooh. Ruby Obelisk is cool. An unknown century? What does that mean? Why would it be an unknown century? up here. I could stack these kind of funny. Oops. I think that's clearly man-made, which is kind of cool. How about that? There we go. That's kind of cool. Can we move this somewhere more like here? Yeah. The sun warmed lion's fear. Oh, I like this. That's pretty. Okay. Yeah, this could be a landscape one. Um, I want to be able to get the obelisk in the back, so we'll go to a wider aperture. And then that looks good. And you could do a little bit of a pan. Oh yeah, get that. Oh yeah. Like that's cool and all, but oh. That's super cool. Hmm. That kind of changes my point of view on a lot of things. Well, we'll go with this. Yeah, like this looks really cool. Focused into like here. Yeah, look at that. Maybe another one. That's cool. Okay, let's take it. Check out another place. Tall Hoven, shrouded in fog. That could be cool. Tall spired building can be seen, set around a very large central rock. We haven't seen a lot of building things. Fresh coat of sunrises, wind blows, a hearth far from anywhere. Hmm. Life's birth. Sun is high in the sky. Let's go uh, Tall Hoven, see if we can see this building or spire or something it said. Did it say building? Whoa, this is cool. Uh, okay, for artifacts we had to like drop something into it, like a rock maybe? Or an ordinary stone, here you go. Grab it and like drop it in. Yeah, whoa. Am I getting gems out of these? No? City wall, it says, whoa. Oh, look at this. All right, that's pretty cool. Gems. Was this their son? Missed the rest of that. Alright, this is cool. Now, there was some walls and stuff, right? Yeah, look at this. So how much bigger could these be? A lot bigger. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop growing. Stop growing, buddy. Come on. Okay. I wanted it bigger, but... This one doesn't want to go bigger. Oh, interesting. Because it would be kind of cool to put it bigger. Oh, this is stuck now going bigger. Oops. Did we lose it? It's kind of a bummer if we did. Well, we could do it like this then. People could wonder why would there have been multiple of these. Spires. They're turning in odd directions from what I actually want. Maybe because of the positioning of the rocks and stuff. 
Okay, interesting. Oh, this is there now. Alright, so where was the spire? Whoa, look at this. It's really pretty. Oh, there it is. It's kind of an awkward position, though, to get the light of this. this. I wish I could do some fun stuff with these uh, walls, but I'm having trouble controlling them. Kind of looks funky, though, which is cool. Oh, maybe up a little bit. Like this. Kind of cool. Cool. All right, let's check out. Let's check out another spot. Okay. Clock whale. Scatter with many large rocks. Thunder skies. Soon it will be dusk. A paved floor. Decide an intimidating wheel to spire in the distance. Eagle strife. Freezing cold and windy. Far from anywhere. Around a stone bench. That's kind of cool. And then it squires furs, a rocky floor scattered with many large rocks. The sky is clear. Low rocks. Okay, let's. Remains of an old statue. Oh, let's try Eagle Strife. Ooh. A lot of things here. Oh, there's like feathers or something blowing in the wind or leaves, maybe? So many gems. it open. Oh, there's a lot more s hidden in here. Oh, there we go. So I want this to be bigger. Like that. And then... Like this, kind of... Much more wooded than we normally would be. So you feel like you're in like a little protected clearing here, but there's still obviously like a big cliff off in the distance. Yeah. Like this. I don't know what to do with the pillar. Can we drop it? Huh. No. We'll tuck it back in there. There you go. Alright, let's get a picture of this. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, I like the zoom out. And I think for this one you do want to be able to get a lot of it in focus. That's pretty cool. I mean, black and white's nice too. Which was the one I thought was kind of cool? Oh, maybe this one dual tint. All right, let's take this picture. All right, cool. Well, I think this is probably a good place to take a break. Um, it seems like you kind of just keep going area by area as long as you want. Um, I gotta say, I do think this the visuals of this are really, really beautiful. I could totally see messing around in here for a little bit and then getting like a desktop background or something for my PC. Um, I wish there was a little more, I mean, maybe I'm just missing it. 
and you you can actually discover this if you're clever enough. But I wish there was a little bit more to like to discover in terms of like combinations or things you could put together or things like that. I think it'd be kind of cool to be able to check that stuff out. But um, it's really stunning how pretty these all look and like very realistic, especially even as you can go move things around and plop them down, plop down uh, things. But yeah. There must be some more stuff to discover. Like, I'm not totally sure that the goal of all the gems are, for example. Um, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed that a lot. Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, go ahead and leave me comments. Let me know if you try it out, see what you think. Um, I'll put a, a link in the description to the, um, the website or the Steam page for the game for those of you who want to check it out. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.